welcome back to my channel I know I've been MIA in YouTube for so long I've been gone and because I was super busy with my work and I couldn't get the chance to film for you guys so I'm back after almost two weeks now I think and yeah I'm super happy to be back and make a video for you guys because I have missed doing this so much but yeah for today's video uh, I would like to show you guys my current um, products or things that I like and share it with you guys and plus also non products I have like a two non beauty products which I would like to share it with you guys and I think the last current video that I made was last year a few months back and yeah it's been like it's been really long time that I've been I did that video and I hope you guys like such kind of videos it's not like a beauty or makeup video that I'm doing like how I always do it's just something very different so if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so so you guys can see what I do like basically <laughs> so yeah whenever I post a video you guys will be notified if you click on that bell button enough of talking let's get right to the video Talking about skincare, I would like to talk about face wash that I've been using. This is Cetaphil uh, face wash. This is just the classic uh, face wash. It is dermatology uh, tested. It is very uh, gentle on your skin. It is for all skin type. I started to use this face wash because I went through some medication on my face for my acne which I got last year so when I was in medication the medicine that what my dermatologist gave me was super super strong for me my skin started to be super super sensitive I had to purchase a very classic um, very gentle on the skin face wash if you guys have very sensitive skin or even dry skin this product is amazing because it really nourishes your skin it really makes your skin soft without ripping off the uh, natural uh, oil that you have or you know ripping off your skin or making it irritated this is my second bottle that i have finished it and this is actually empty i need to buy a new one it does also take out makeup i wouldn't say this is super super cheap but it's it is quite affordable so you can just check it out in your local store and yeah this is this has been so amazing on my skin so and i absolutely love this so next after talking about removing or taking out makeup i've been loving this l'oreal like a cream this is the new product that l'oreal has come up with and actually using this for a week or so and I've been absolutely loving this product very thin in texture very creamy very moussey it literally smells like rose and jasmine what I like to do is um, like the first time when I remove my makeup with the oil based uh, makeup remover so you just need a little bit just apply it in your hand and massage it on your face make the product sink in your face and then it really melts your makeup it really goes on your skin take a cotton ball and just remove it my face feels literally very smooth if you guys are looking for something to remove your like looking for a product to remove your makeup give this a try talking about skincare the next skincare which i'm absolutely absolutely so fond of and this is also by l'oreal this is the um Hydrogenous Aloe Water Moisturizer This has literally changed my life Oh my god And the good thing about this is that it has a pump Which is really really hygienic uh, The liquid care inspired by Korean technology As you know Koreans, Korean products are known for the products, the skincare and all that It is super famous Their formulas are meant for 
making the skin really good so i'm really proud of l'oreal or really impressed by l'oreal that they have done that for people who cannot afford a high-end product for skincare because skincare is really important so as you know in summer the hydration is a must for skin it can be really dry really it can really strip your face in summer so this product is amazing to bring back the hydration on your skin and make it look fresh and healthy throughout the day i use this product morning and night after my skincare or face wash and all that when i clean my face i use this and seriously you guys i feel my skin like very silky very smooth it is supposed to hold 72 hours of hydration on your skin you guys should really check this out the next and the last uh, product for the skincare would be this little guy here the package is super cute the pink love pink so this is sun may massage facial uh, instrument i got it months months back i think i got it last year i think i posted a picture also in my instagram so this i got it from Amazon there are many facial you know cleanser or massager on the market there are high-end low-end wherever I was searching for really affordable face massager which which could exfoliate my skin and I came across this product it comes like this in a box and it comes with a charger so there are many different colors I chose the pink one because I love pink it comes in like a there is like a small flower really good there are like the two sides this side and this side and it comes with the pointier side it's really good to go in on your you know the nose like this part because you cannot go like this so this part is really cool for this and it comes with the buttons to do the speed like you know there is some more speed there is less speed depending on what kind of massage do you want and this side is like to charge your to charge the battery this is like bacteria free even when you put it on your when you keep this on your bathroom there are a lot of bacteria the germs after you wash and it's, it's like super you really need to be careful this after i use it i just wash and keep it in my bathroom it's made out of silicone i bet i guess i can travel with this it's super cute just i just pump in my face wash whatever face wash that i'm using and then i just go in and massage it gently like for a few minutes and then i just rinse it off that's it i use it like once or twice a week just to exfoliate and take out all my dead skins and after this when i do this my makeup goes on so smooth so good and if i find the link i will put it down below for you guys so you guys can check it out so for the next product that will be the foundation the l'oreal um, total coverage foundation uh, foundation is amazing but if you have a dry skin I would not suggest you to use this but if you have a normal skin or combination skin or oily skin this product is amazing and this pretty much covers your face and it is a very moussey kind of a texture and I just I just dab in on my face and just just take a beauty blender or a brush and just like it covers almost everything I don't have any complaints on this and I like it I don't hate it but I like it it, it, it just gets the job done so next product which I want to talk about is the powder the essence all about matte fixing compact powder and this is in the shade translucent this this is like my everyday found like the powder that I use after I use the foundation I just grab this and use this small like a sponge thingy this just helps like keep the foundation in place like when i set under my eye the product the powder stays all day i don't have any complaint plus this is like just like few bucks it's not expensive at all so every day i use this product and i'm good to go so next i won't say product but it's like a kind of a beauty thingy i don't know what i'm saying but how to say a puff I've been loving this puff a lot because um, I 
don't use um, brushes anymore to set my makeup with the powder I just use this I think this is just the classic puff that you can get in any compact that you buy but when I use the puff what I've noticed that it makes the, the powder stick to the foundation and it just sticks in together and stays in place all day if you know what I'm trying to say but like yeah it, you just I just press it on my face and yeah I'm good to go it's so much easier you get this slight thingy that you just slide it and you just go ta 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 and you're good to go so yeah this is like my another favorite which I've been loving so far this doesn't come with this I bought it extra so I just put it inside fix fits like perfectly inside the compact and I just take it in my purse whenever I'm going out I get oily I just dab it wherever I need and this is in my purse every day so moving on to the next product would be some of my favorite eyeshadow which I've been loving so far the essence eyeshadows which comes in a lot of like small travel size if you want some shine if you're going out and you want to just put it on your bag this is perfect I got in the shade Tiffany and Raspberry if you don't have time and you're going out you just put it in your bag and apply it on your eyeshadow for a little bit of glam next eyeshadows that I want to talk about is been my favorite is the balm that's what I have it on my lid today and I've been absolutely loving it. I just got it in the mail like a week back and I cannot, I cannot, <laughs> and I cannot stop putting it. And these are the ColourPop eyeshadows. It is a US brand which ship worldwide. And by the way, they just sell like eyeshadows, um, highlighters, blushes, and I think uh, eyeliner. That's it. They don't do foundation and they didn't do like a concealer and brushes they didn't do all that yeah so when i subscribed to their newsletter i got a mail saying that they are doing free shipping so i really had to get it so i just got a few products from them not too much got like just like this four eyeshadows super cute i have them in my lid today and the extra one was this one which comes uh, this is in the shade paper tiger I've never used this kind of shade before. It's really good for crease and that's what I have on my crease today. I am amazed with the pigmentation. It's so creamy. It glides on so well. You don't even need a brush. You can just use your like fingers to dab in. Everyday look amazing. They have so many range of colors if you're looking out to like try ColourPop eyeshadows. Just go in to their website and just check if they have any offers going on and if you don't want to waste your money on free ship like of shipping charges just wait till they have like a free free international shipping that's what I did this is in the shade flipper and another one is called one by one and the other one is called going rogue and the last one is known as itty bit and um yeah, you can just use like one eyeshadow, put it all over your lid and you're good to go. The shimmers, the pigmentation is so good. It, there are no fallouts whatsoever. I've used it. This is like my second time. First time I just tried it and this is like for the video I used this uh, eyeshadow. Looks amazing. Looks so cute. I really love this. If you check out their website. You're gonna love it. It's so cute. <laughs> to the next product will be the mascara. This is by Kiko. Comes in a wand like this. This is in the shade black. But I don't think this is like waterproof. We don't say it, but I don't mind. I got this in sale. I've been using it every day, non-stop. But one thing about uh, mascara from Kiko is that when you apply, when it dries, it just like crumbles and like falls a little bit on your like face on your eye area here that it's the that is the only disclaimer that i hate about kiko mascaras but other than that it is so affordable it makes your lashes like lengthy and a little bit spidery but not so spidery you know what i mean like it gives a little bit volume and length which i absolutely love i didn't use um 
spots is every day so I have to have to have to use mascara even though I'm not applying eyeliner I need mascara so yeah it does the job so I am not complaining one is this Kiko um, full coverage concealer I love the packaging the black packaging it reminds me like the MAC packaging I believe this um, is like the best seller. It comes in the category for the best seller products from Kiko. And I used it a little bit, then I stopped it, but when I used it again, I love it. I really love that it comes with a mirror and it's very small and compact. Formula is really good. And I use this especially like when uh, there are like mocks sticking to. I use it before the foundation adapt on the areas that I want to cover and then after that I apply foundation on top of this check this product out I'm in the shade 04 there comes in a lot of shades so love this product next product which I want to talk about is the uh, contouring palette this is by makeup revolution um, this is their iconic lights and contouring pro palette and it comes in a lot of uh, different contouring shades as you can see this one I use it for bronzing these two are like the highlights which I don't use, I haven't touched it and these two are the powder to set your face with the yellow and the translucent one I have used it but not so fan of it but the contouring shades are the bomb it is not chalky at all for me some people find it chalky but I don't mind it this is okay for me I, I used today on my face I've been grabbing this a lot if I have to contour so have a look in makeup revolution section or website you guys can get it it's very affordable and you get the choice of like you know the colors that you want so for the next product which is everyone's favorite are the highlighters by the bomb these are the sisters highlight and i got in all the shades using uh, this highlighter today on my face like if you can see on my forehead my nose and my cupid bow and this is like everyday highlighter it's not so on the face but it is there the shine is there but these two shades are my favorite which is amazing the formula is really good I love the packaging it comes in like the little magnetic kind of a box it's really nice that it comes with a mirror amazing love it yeah I have this also on my like the collarbone area and it does have shine I really love this product this has been like my go-to highlighter a product which I want to talk about is uh, the eyebrow for the eyebrows um, these are the essence make me brow gel mascara I believe this is like the dupe for um, benefit a uh, brow gel um, I haven't used that but I heard that this is like the dupe for this and this is like just few bucks I don't use the like the powder um, or the pomade to do my brow I just need to fill up in the front a little bit and I'm good to go I love the applicator, it's really small it's not the big chunky one where it spreads like everywhere when you put it but it's like the small one so you can just go in the brow I just like to like go a little bit it just gives that a little bit of um, fullness and also it makes my eyebrows stick together all day and if this one product just does the job I have it on my brows today that I want to talk about are the lip products I have three favorite lippies okay the first one I want to talk about is the one which I haven't have on my lips today this is the L'Oreal Paris um, in the shade Vivid Rose oh my god I you have the old shade which has been your favorite for so long and then you buy new ones and this just goes in the box like really down and you don't find it and you forget it this is what happened with this i just recently saw this i found this and i just applied it and it was like so yeah it comes with a mirror amazing when you want to touch up your lipstick this has the mirror you just 
take your lipstick and just look in the mirror it's not a clear mirror but it is there so you can just touch up and yeah this is a very nice summery color which I have on today and looks so good looks very um, rosy but has a bit of a red, red tone to it but looks so good in summer and it is really hydrating it's not the matte one I think this is like the old L'Oreal lipstick I don't know if you guys will still get it but just have a look if you guys have L'Oreal store nearby and if you guys get it get in the shade Vivid Rose amazing for summer uh, product which I want to talk about is the Kiko um, Kiss Balm this is in the shade um, doesn't have a shade ah this is in the shade uh, Blackberry and this I've been using from last year and this I have almost hit the pan I don't have it anymore this is my like everyday go-to um, lip balm which I'm going it does have a bit, a bit of a sheen to it and it does give you a bit very natural color not like this one and it has 15 SPF which is always good in summer this is like every day when I'm out for work I just apply this and it looks very natural on the lips and but the problem about this that it go away fast so you have to like really reapply it again and again if you're looking for something with to apply every day this is the one for you the product that I want to talk about is a nail polish remover what I used to do is like oh it's just nail polish remover so I'm just gonna buy a cheap one and just remove my nail polish but no that's not the case when I start I saw this this is by Rimmel um, this is with glycerin and vitamin E which helps your nails when you remove them to really nourish and it won't make your nails dry and flaky you know some cheap uh, nail polish remover does that but it has glycerin and vitamin E which helps it uh, maintain the kind of nail you have without damaging your nails so um, I just use it in a cotton ball and remove my makeup uh, re remove my nail polish and it takes away your nail polish so fast so quick it doesn't have that bad kind of smell in the cotton ball when you do it it doesn't have that full-on alcohol smell on your nose it does have a bit of a scent to it so you won't get irritated but I've been ex absolutely loving this nail polish remover so check out on your Remel section in your local market and have a look it could change your nail polish uh, removing game the last beauty product that I, I want to talk about is uh, the setting spray this is by Urban Decay All Nighter setting spray this has changed my makeup game and it makes my makeup set so beautifully and doesn't look cakey it melts uh, the makeup together and it looks so natural so good it makes uh, my skin so hydrating so refresh after you use it you can always use it before or after I use it after my makeup to set everything and just stay so long throughout the day if you're going out at night try this out if you if you have like a long day this setting spray is a must it is so good it is a bit high-end but it's uh, worth a try you guys can try it so I have a uh, last two favorites which is not a beauty product fashion product so the first thing I want to show you are these platforms by Zara this is so cute oh my god and it has a bow I got this long time back but it's not the regular round pump shoe this has the pointy thing pointy front and it does have a little bit of platform which i always need because i'm short pink but mixed with cream color can go with anything um and um been loving this so much i haven't used it but i've used it once i think but yeah i've been absolutely adoring this you can always dress it up or down you can use it with jeans or even with the skirt and it won't look bad at all uh, and the last favorite this video is uh, this bag this this is not a bag it's a box but this is the camellia roma a bag which i got it for my birthday isn't it so cute oh my god i love this bag 
you can oh this looks so chic there is a strap which you can use or you can always like take it out and also if you don't want the strap you always have like a bag here i really love this color it is so cute this uh this is an italian brand and they sell only bags for women they have a variety of uh bags i don't know if they ship um like worldwide but if i know i will leave the link down below for you guys to check it out and they have so many wide range of colors that you can choose from the design is so good and the material is very nice it's not the those kind of bag which is very stiff and then you cannot take it out this is very a soft material bag so yeah, this bag uh, I posted on Instagram and uh, they have featured my bag in their Instagram account. I will leave the link down below of the Instagram account and the website. You guys can check it out. Guys, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you guys liked this video and liked my favorites. I think that's all the favorites that I could collect for this video. And I know it's been a bit long video, but hey, I just wanted to make it up for my long gone in the youtube so yeah i just wanted to make this video for you guys i hope you liked it and enjoyed it and as much as i liked and enjoyed making this video for you guys so yeah that's it for now until next time